What's up, fish tube? Bearded Bob once again. Well, my uh, trick with adding guppies to these tanks to help combat my hydro problem did absolutely nothing. Uh, they did go through and eat all of the cyclops and all the other little things that uh, the hydro were eating, I believe. Uh, but they did not eat the hydra. They didn't even touch it. So I think it just kind of started dying back a little bit because it was out of food. Um, I also didn't feed these guys um, for uh, I'd go five days without food and then I'd feed them one day and then I'd go five more days without food. And uh, yeah, that didn't do anything. So yesterday, uh, I remembered I had this Planaria Zero and this also works supposedly to kill Hydra. So I mixed up a batch. Um, this is the dosage that I was using. It's actually one scoop per six gallons uh, and then one scoop per 12. But to make it easier on myself, I did this. Um, all the inhabitants seem to be doing well. My shrimp seem to be doing well, even though they're all hiding because there's tons of guppies in this tank now. Uh, and there's no food sitting out front, so they're all hiding. So we dumped that in yesterday. That was uh, dose one. You gotta dose this two days at the higher dosage. And then on day three, you do half the dosage. Um, I got this off of Amazon. Uh, here is uh, the literage and all that stuff. But basically what I'm doing is um, there's a spoon that comes in this bag. It's uh, one gram when you uh, level it off. So I use that spoon. I do two scoops in a little bit of water here, mix it all up, dump it in one tank. I turn off the uh, water going to these tanks for a little while so that it all kind of stays in the tank and I dose all of these tanks uh, and then after about an hour or so I'll turn the water back on and get the water flowing again because um, at that point it's all in one system and they should all be dosed correctly uh, following this. This one's a little bit more tricky because it's not full at 20 gallons. Um, it's probably, I'm, I, I was betting on 15 gallons so that's what I aimed for when I uh, was dosing. Um, but like I said, as you can see, no fish deaths. Uh, people were saying that it killed all their snails. I, I haven't seen that yet. We'll, uh, we'll see it if, if it does it, you know, when I dose it again today here. But I figured I'd uh, give you an update on that. And uh, I'll go ahead and mix up a couple batches and dump them in and show you guys how we uh, go about doing that. And uh, let me uh, get some water here and I'll be right back. And we're back. Okay. So, what I'm going to do here is open up this pouch. Uh, so, this stuff is uh, betel nut, or betel nut, however you want to say it. Uh, extract, or betel nut wax extract, something to that effect. But this little spoon comes in the bag, and... Uh, each one of these spoons is treats six gallons. I'm using it a little bit higher dosage because um, I've used it before this way and it worked fine. Nobody died. So there it is, two spoons in there. And then I'm just gonna use one of these pipettes to, because uh, they're disposable and better to not contaminate everything, including, you know, like a kitchen spoon. Don't wanna do that. Wife might get mad. All right, so that's that. I don't know if you can see in there. Very terrible lighting. Let's go over to the aquarium and we'll dump this in. There we go. There's our extract liquid. We're gonna dump it in. I'll show you from here. We're gonna let it go crazy in there and stir all around. Uh, it's also recommended that you add uh, a little bit more aeration, so I turned up the bubblers in here. I'm gonna shut off the water valve to this one and uh, we'll just let it do its thing. In a couple hours, we'll turn this water back on and get everything flowing again. But you can see it kind of clouds everything up and it's kind of murky for uh, a couple hours at least uh, until all this uh, stuff kind of goes, it dissolves in the water or whatever, whatever it does. Um, but I used to have a pile of planaria all the way down this wall and I haven't seen them in a couple of days. So, uh, this, let's see if we can get it out of that really. Yeah, they were definitely covering this wall a pretty good amount. 
Um, and not for a couple of days, I should say. Uh, yesterday I dosed this tank, and by last night I didn't notice any uh, Hydra. Did I say Planaria before? I must have. Okay, Hydra. Hydra is what we're treating. So, that's what it looks like. I'm going to go through and uh, do the rest of these aquariums. And uh, if you have any comments or questions, or if you have anything else that you uh, do use, uh, more of a natural product like this one is supposed to be, um, leave a little comment down below and uh, we can get a conversation going about it. I'd appreciate it. All right. Uh, and if you haven't, you know, like, subscribe to the Bearded Bob. Peace.